Jai Gurudev. Uh, the question I've received today is, uh, how do I know if I'm doing the right action? How do I decide between the right action or the wrong action? Especially when somebody is trying to put, put us down, saying that, saying that it's the wrong action, it's the wrong decision. You know, Gurudev gives a very beautiful, uh, beautiful knowledge, saying that that which brings long-term happiness but short-term struggle, that's the right action, right decision. And that which brings long-term misery but short-term happiness, that's a, a bad action or the wrong action, wrong decision. Uh, for example, let's say you're a student and uh, in one month you have uh, your degree exams coming up. So one month you struggle hard, that is short-term struggle. So what happens after one month, you'll be able to clear the exams, get a job, and in the long term, you'll be able to lead a very successful, happy life. On the other hand, if you waste this one month of time in partying with friends, you know, gossiping, Netflix, unnecessary, uh, um, unnecessary talking to friends, then what happens is long term, you'll only stress. The short term, you will fail in the exam and long term, you'll only have to suffer. So that which brings long term happiness, but short term struggle. So if you are struggling now and you know that long term this will give me, give me good, uh, good gains, then that's a good decision. And as far as people trying to put, put that decision, put that action down, saying that this is not the right action. This is not. See, there are two kinds of people, you know, who will criticize you. The first kind of people, they really want your growth. They say they are risking their friendship, they are risking their relationship with you, and they say this is not the way it is to be done, especially somebody who is on the spiritual path. With them, you just thank them for showing the way. They are risking their relationship and showing the way. On the other hand, there are other kinds of friends who just criticize you out of jealousy, out of small-mindedness. They cannot stand your growth. Now, those are the second kind of people. With them, you just be compassionate, educate, and ignore. You know. So long-term happiness and short-term misery. That's the formula for right action. Now, another thing is, you know, no matter how much good you do in the society or in your job, there will be 10 people who will criticize you. Yes or no? The second thing kind of people is, no matter how much bad you do, there will be 20, 50 people who will support you. You know, look at all the politicians. They have at least 50 people around them. Yes or no? So... So then why give too much importance to people's opinion? For this, you need to be really strong. You know, people will say, some people will say today that you're good. The same people today, tomorrow, they'll say that you're bad. So this is where the yoga, meditation will make, make your inner faculty so strong, number one. And two, your intuitive ability increases, saying that what is right action, what is wrong action. By meditating regularly, you will, you're in touch of the depth of intuitive power. That will also help in making the right decision, right action. I hope I answered your question. Chai Gurudev.